what's up again guys for today's vlog I will going to answer the activity 6 which is IP characteristics so let's go so instructions reach is IP characteristics then click connections plus before best effort or media independent to indicate delivery method so IP characteristics no contact is made with destination host before sending a packet so connection less the IP characteristics will adjust size of packet sent depending on what type of network access will be used I think media independent so the third is does not guarantee that the packet will be delivered fully without errors best effort so Fiber optics, cabling, satellites, and wireless can all be used to route the same packet. It's media independent. So, will send a packet even destination host is not able to receive it. I think connection less. Okay. Packet delivery is not guaranteed. So best effort. Okay, check. So let's proceed to second activity. The second activity is identify elements of a rotor, routing, table, and tree. So let's go. The instructions is a particular rotor, routing, table, and tree is shown. Each section of the entry is identified by a circled letter above it. Select the correct routing, table, and tree section of each output. So, the number one question is the elapsed time since the network was discovered. So, I think is letter E. The administrative distance source and metric to reach the remote network. I think is C. So, how the network was learned by the router. I think is A. Show the destination network. I think is B. The next hub IP address to reach remote network. I think is D. And the last question the outgoing interface underwriter to reach the destination network. I think is F. So let's check. Okay. Um, correct so the third activity is description of router function and hardware parts so let's go the instructions is descriptions of router function hardware parts are provided in table drag its router component name to its function description so connects router to external network usually over large distance so I think one interface a way to remotely access the CLI across a network interface um, telnet or SSH connect computer switches and routers for internal networking I think LAN interface a local port which uses USB or low speed serial connections to manage network devices so I think is console up export apart manage rotors or telephone moderns. Console port. Oh, let's check. Oh, uh, console port and aux port. Okay. Check. Okay. So the f the fourth activity is IPv6 header fields. So let's go. The instructions is reach its IPv6 header description and click the IPv6 header field to which it belongs. 
So, descriptions. Identify the application type of the upper protocol. So, I think is next header. So, classifies packet congestion control. I think traffic class. To suggest all packets receive that same type of handling IPv6 routers. Flow level. When value 0 as the sender is notified packets is delivered. Half limit. Is always set to 0110. Oh, it's a version. And the last is identify the size of the portion of the packet. So, also, payload length. So, it's correct. And the last activity is IPv4 header fields. So let's go. The instructions is reach each IPv4 header function and then click the IPv4 header field to which it belongs. So always set 01 for IPv4. So I think is version. So identifies the IP address of sending host. I think source IP address identifies the upper layer protocol to be used next. I think is oh I think is different differentiated service. I guess. Okay, protocol identifies okay protocol. So identifies the property of each packet. So I think differentiated service commonly referred to as shop count. Time to leave. And the last is identifies IP address of the recipient host. Uh, also destination IP address. So correct. Okay guys, thank you for watching.